Remember who made you come. Uh. Uh. Who did it be, Spider-Man? <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. Let's saying? go, Mets. <laughs> it's all about the Mets, baby. Are you in? Or are you out? Why do I make him sound like the grandma from Spongebob that doesn't like chocolate? <laughs> what do you mean he's selling chocolate? Chocolate? You're selling what? I thought they stopped selling those in 1800s. <laughs> I think it's Tom Kenny who voices the grandma. Tom Kenny's a god. Just let him voice everyone. What's the worst? How do I... Okay, I see. Give me on the blue. Oh right, I, this is what I've I got been, a sneeze coming. What this no, is it's gone. What, what I've been trying to say. I've been trying to stay awake fully for a day, but it's not happening. I reached like a certain point, and then my body is like shut down. That's for Palestinian Larry. Change it to <laughs> death for Palestinians. Larry, please don't. <laughs> Two episodes in a row. Give me these nuts and bolts, just to... <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, you don't leave them- you don't just don't leave them hanging around? What the fuck am I missing here? Oh, oh. I remembered. I know- I know what I could do now. A thing you that can happened- can dive into the water. You can? Yeah. Uh, oh. This water does not look safe to dive into, nor does it look safe to even swim in. Nor is there any reason for me to dive into it. Can I get in through here? Possibly. Can I go... What the fuck? I, I guess not. We're breaking the game. <laughs> it's over here. Uh, a thing that happened since the last time we recorded, uh... I finished Breath of the Wild. Oh, yeah. I got all 120 shrines in that game. It was a fucking labor of love, I'll tell you that. Hello, Ellie. <laughs> I mean, I'm under the water. <laughs> Hello, I'm under the water. Where, didn't I have a... There we go. Uh, oh, we're in a Starbucks. Yeah. My impressions are that that is one of the greatest games I've ever made. Good impressions. Is there anything else you want to say? Uh, I want to take Zelda to Pound Town. I mean, but that's not news. That, that's not news. I mean, just look at her, bro. Larry, put her up. God damn. <laughs> Showcasing her like she's a metal. See, women aren't objects. Come on. Oh, this place stinks. Yeah, Thank you, Ellie. Did you go to coffee shop for that? <laughs> Does anyone have a MacBook? I need to finish oh, my screenplay. <laughs> <laughs> screenplay for your movie that won't ever get fucking greenlit, buddy. I mean, <laughs> I mean. Let's be real. It will get <laughs> greenlit. Oh yeah, and then he's gonna spend like what? Ten thousand dollars on the fucking movie budget, and then the movie's gonna get like, oh, he's gonna be all proud and shit of his movie, and then I don't know who this hypothetical person is, but I don't know why I'm so angry at them. <laughs> and then they're gonna make him one good movie, and then they're gonna start talking shit about Man of Steel and Superman. And then they're gonna yeah, but, yeah, but not all talk the... about the fact that their dad got someone killed no, during stupid. a movie. Uh, yeah, but yeah, but DC DC Universe movies fucking actually suck though. They're bad. But this guy's opinions are wrong. Mine? No, I'm talking. Oh. <laughs> the hypothetical person. I'm talking about Max Landis, son of a guy who directed. He directed the Twilight Zone movie, which had like... Yeah, John Landis. He's a famous director. He, yeah. And he got someone killed on set. Or no, I no, mean, not, not someone. 
three two people. people. Is it, no, it was three people. Two kids and the the main actor. If I recall, it wasn't his fault though. Um, as a John, director, you're supposed to make sure everything's safe to go. Yeah, but John Landis isn't the one fucking piloting the helicopter, dog. <laughs> he wasn't the one that was. He's like, the one. He directed the helicopter to go lower, and lower towards any made. He he forgot to make sure if the explosives weren't near the hold helicopter. On. It's his fault. What else did John Landis direct? He's famous for something what else. Are you doing? Uh, uh, Blues Brothers. There we go. That's what. That's what I know from. That's one hell of a film to be known for. And uh, he also did a uh, the music video for Thriller. Sick. Um, what am I missing? Need combination. Wonderful. How am I supposed to find a? <clears throat> okay, here we go. Uh, the filming location was the ranch Indian Dunes that was used through the 1980s in film and television shows, including The Color Purple, Skip, yada, yada, yada. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Um. I mean, he went to court for it. He got, like... The night scene called for Morrow's character to carry the two children out of a deserted village across a shallow river while being pursued by American soldiers in a hovering helicopter. The helicopter was piloted by Vietnam War veteran Dorsey Wingo. During the filming, Wingo stationed his helicopter 25 feet from the ground while hovering near a large mortar effect. He then turned the aircraft 180 degrees to the left for the next camera shot. The effect was detonated while the helicopter's tail ro rotor was still above it, causing the rotor to, fa to fail and detach from the tail. The low-flying helicopter spun out of control. At the same time, Morrow dropped Chen into the water. He was, he, was re he was reaching out to grab her when the helicopter fell on top of him and two children. Maro and Lee were decapitated by the helicopter's main rotor blades while Chen was crushed to death by the helicopter's right landing skid. All three died instantaneously. Did the, the pilot die? No, I don't believe so. Uh, at the trial, the defense claimed the explosions were detonated at the wrong time. Ronald Robinson was an assistant camera on board at the helicopter. He testified that production manager Don Allingham told Wingo, that's too much, let's get out of here, when the explosions were detonated. But, Lon but Landis shouted over the radio, get lower, get lower. Robinson See? said that Wingo tried to leave the area, but we lost our control and regained, and that we can feel something let go as we begun spinning around in our circles. Stefan, Stefan Ledecker, also a camera operator on board, testified that Landis had earlier shrugged off warnings about the stunt with the comment, we may lose the helicopter. Ledecker acknowledged that Landis may have been joking when he made the remark, but he said, I learned to not take anything that man said as a joke. It was his attitude. He didn't time. He didn't have the time to suggestions from anybody. Uh, investigation. The... F FAA, uh, Federal Aviation Administration, had just instituted regulations in March of that year how to define how aircraft were to be regulated during film and television productions. The new regulations, however, were only covered to only covered fixed-wing aircraft and not helicopters. As a, result, as a result of the fatal incident, the National Transport Safety Board recommended the terms be extended to apply all types of aircraft. Um, uh, buh, 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 let's see. Uh, all so, four... Yeah. All four parents testified that they were never told that would hel there would be helicopters or explosives on set, and they had been reassured that there would be no danger, only noise. Lee survived the Vietnam War and immigrated with his wife to the United States, and he was horrified when the explosions began on the Vietnam Vietnamese village set, bringing back memories of the war. Um, Landis, Fulsey, Wingo, production manager, Allingham, and explosive specialist Paul Stewart were tried and acquitted on charges of manslaughter in a nine-month trial in 1986 and 1987. Morrow's family settled within a year. The children's family collected millions of dollars from several civil lawsuits. Hey! So yeah, fuck Jan, John Landis. Uh, oh, I, I'm, I'm reading a little bit more just to find any uh, more interesting things to say about it. Uh, <clears throat> that footage is horrifying to watch. I have not bothered to watch it. I have seen a picture of right before the crash was going to happen, but I have not seen the footage. Uh, Landis spoke about the accident in a 1996 interview. Quote, There was absolutely no good aspect about this whole story. The tragedy with the Think About Every Day had an enormous impact on my career from which, may have ne from, which it may it, from which it may possibly never recover. Filmmaker, filmmaker Steven Spielberg co-produced the film with Landis, but he broke off their friendship following the accident. Spielberg said the crash, quote, made me grow up a little more, 
end quote, and left everyone who has worked on the movie sick to the center of their souls. He added, quote, no movie is worth dying for. I think people are standing up much more now than ever before to producers and directors who ask too much. If something isn't safe, it's the right and responsibility of every actor or crew member to be all cut. And there you go. So yeah, that guy. I mean, Max, Max Lenz didn't do anything, but he's just kind of a shithead. Ah! Oh, why? Why couldn't he just let me smash his friend in the head? You wanted to smash his friend? In the head. Oh, I, I, I see what you're into now here. <laughs> yeah. Now that I've came out. Uh. <laughs> All right, Larry. Uh, it's just you, the way I wanted during Last of Us. You can use that. You can use that soundbite for uh, whatever may need be. Sure. Excuse me, sir. Oh, oh. <laughs> Swing and a miss, sir. Sir. Oh, oh. Oh, good job, Ellie. Thank you, Ellie. All right. All right, bro. Guys, guys, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, truth, 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 truth. I didn't mean it, I didn't mean it, I didn't mean it. Man. 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 After Please. grabbing a human. <laughs> Just grab your local human. <laughs> All right. Let's do sneaky time this time. Dun -dun. As I pull out the shotgun. Dun -dun. Dun -dun. Shotguns might be the most least, there might be the least inconspicuous Sir? fucking weapon Sir? ever. <laughs> Bro, after the third hit with the pipe, you should probably stay down. After the third? Yeah. You know, maybe the person isn't strong enough to. Most human beings, after this. one hit with a fucking rusted pipe, get fucking cocked oh. out. <laughs> Beautiful. Where is Joel getting these arrows from? I picked it up earlier. Can it's he? It's unlimited arrows like it's Zelda. Zelda doesn't even have unlimited arrows. You're now gonna tell me that I'm completely wrong, and that I should kill myself for not knowing such information. Uh, actually, A Link Between Worlds does have unlimited arrows. Uh, not kill yourself, Harry. <laughs> I said Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Oh, did you say Breath of the Wild? I didn't hear that part. <laughs> we got, I think we're finished here, so I'm gonna just run around and find Next these it. little nuts and bolts around. What does this say? Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> Go this yeah. direction for Banjo Kazooie. What did I? The, what, where are you getting Banjo Kazooie from? Because you said nuts and bolts. Oh. <sighs> that 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 hurt my mind for a little bit. <laughs> As I was looking at the letters, I'm like, how do you see Banjo-Kazooie in this? You unintentionally made a layup for me. <laughs> Bro, I swear I never have ammo for this pistol. <laughs> Man. The picture of the horse that just says, <laughs> Man. Uh, Larry, put up the picture of the horse, and then, and then put up the picture with the raccoon. There's a raccoon picture as well? There's a raccoon picture that says man. It was it's just, it's like the really it's the baby raccoon sitting down. And then people were saying like this is this is raccoon, Rocky Raccoon after Infinity War in Guardians 3. There was right, a... that situation was tough when uh James Gunn lost the <laughs> lost the job after some tweets surfaced. I Look, and I'll say this. Yes, I agree. One should always, one should preferably not put out anything that they don't want to be out there. But also, he didn't I, even put. No, but like, this is what I'm saying. Also, can you hate somebody for changing? Like this is a narrative that I hate a lot. Like, some people will say like, "Oh, this person said like these terrible things on Twitter." Like. Seven years ago, it's like, are you the same person you were seven years ago? Of, of, fucking, of course not. Like, 
why are you gonna like especially when like i hate it when it happens to like players on like sports teams and stuff i'll be like he said some homophobic tweets like a while back yeah i mean <laughs> the alex caruso tweet yeah but alex caruso is a fucking god <laughs> he's going gave him the pass what what alex caruso what oh no I, I was wondering why you were just standing it's okay. <laughs> what? What is this? Did the army just come in here during an apocalypse going on outside where people are getting eaten just to put these on doors? Army. <laughs> just fucking. Oh, cool. You snaked him. Nope. He said, son of a bitch. That means others heard. Son of a bitch. Sure. Maybe me running will alert them. <laughs> Thank you, Joel. But it right. didn't, didn't. Where are the other humans? They're not human, Harry. They never were human, Harry. Join us. I forgot what it was. But there was... There was... Some game... That, like, someone brought up, like, the dead count. Mm -hmm. Or, like... The body count of like a, pl a guy. <laughs> yeah. And I think it was like, I, I want to say Uncharted. Yeah. But like, I feel like in Uncharted, he was like talking about how like, whoa, how it was um, inhumane to kill people. And in the game, you kill billions, not even billions, but like a bunch. I need to stop grabbing people when getting shot at. Oh. Oh. <laughs> His legs are gone. <laughs> Let me see them, Johns. I don't know, <laughs> Harry. One shot. This is a thing that I hate about video not games. The and not the yadas. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, no. hey, hey. Stop, stop, stop. Chill, chill. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. If I thing? do it first, he can't do it. <laughs> yeah. You are right don't there, worry, buddy. Don't worry, Ellie. It's just fireworks. <laughs> Ta Maya. Or is it Tayama? I don't remember. What, what are you referring to? Uh, the Japanese firework celebration that's typically held in summer. What is the name? That all, uh, the old romance all, anime All views. anime has it. What is it called? I think it's called Tayama. Or Tamaya. The most blatant use that I remember is, uh... Wait, what? Oh, what? Who is this? This guy's, like, like, completely identical to the other guy with the Molotov. Get your Molotov out of here. The, the word for... What? I, I beat him, and he goes down to the ground, and Ellie already started throwing a brick and completely misses. She said, fuck. Jeez. <laughs> 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 uh, that, that anime called with the robot girl, and the guy falls in love with the robot girl. Uh, uh. <laughs> Man. Man. <laughs> There's too many. Uh, oh, plastic memories, I think. Yeah. That sounds right. That one also had a firework scene. This is a pretty good firework scene, though. The main character always says, I love you when the fireworks going off. Tamaya. I was right. When the fireworks are into the Why sky. Why do these places look exactly like... <laughs> These are symmetric. I don't know which way it is. I mean, the arrows are pointing, but... Arrowpointingdown.com Who put these arrows? What are these arrows here for? Me. I oh, did. Oh, I'm a member of the Snake Eyes. Oh, wait. I can't remember how to go back to my base. Hey. Oi. Wait, the fuck? <laughs> oh, 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 well, hey. man. I at least have vending machines. Prior to start of this recording, I ate a... I ate a cardiac arrest, which is a peanut butter and Nutella sandwich. I feel so, like that was a horrible go, idea. I feel like in terms of food, you can go even worse than that for a cardiac arrest. I feel Bro. like that's not that's not worthy to be called unless uh, unless you put like a whole a whole container of Nutella <laughs> on that motherfucker. <laughs> Just like. <laughs> Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are like the peanut butter jelly were so like there's so much of it that it's not even as a regular sandwich anymore. 
<laughs> Yo, like, what am I doing this for? Just jump onto it? Like, oh. uh, this is not gonna go good. Uh, good thing I'm, this can support my weight jumping on it. I'm not asking to stop doing Gen Zero and Charlie. I'm just asking how we can save them. Ellie? Yeah. What are you saying? Uh, something Sasha. Why are you mumbling to yourself? Something Sasha texted me. Why the fuck am I Alex Jonesing right now? Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> Listen. This next episode of Lucy Norton. It's kind of retarded. Oh. 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 